Good morning, day 81. And as you can see, I'm walking out of town of Unionville. It's uh, 6 a.m., just got, got going. And stop at the deli on the way out, and grab a breakfast sandwich. Um, so today, actually in New York right now, gotta go back into Jersey for like 15 miles. Um, and in Jersey, uh, about 10 miles in, or 12 miles, there's a farmer's market I'm gonna stop at, um, which will be a good place for lunch. And then, I don't know how far I'm gonna go. They said after about 15 miles, we'll finally leave New Jersey uh, for good, so. Um, and be in New York for uh, headed north again. So we'll see, not sure. The plan is just gonna roll with it today. It's kind of cloudy this morning. I think it's supposed to be um, low 70s. So it should be a nice day. Just put some down some miles. Packs heavy, full resupply. But um, that's what it is. Uh, this will be the last town stop for a while. There's not a lot of towns coming up, except unless you hitch it out away from the trail. So not sure where the next town stop will be, but roll the punches this is pretty cool it's an auction house big one too it's a Manning and Clark auction gallery that's a cool cool whole building back in the woods just starting the day got out of the town of Unionville which is a nice little town and uh, and now heading, unfortunately just heading straight east for a while before we turn north. Look at this pretty view. Just came out of the woods onto another field. That's pretty this morning. All right, out of the woods for a little bit. And I've got like a mile road walk into a uh, bird sanctuary. A couple minutes after seven and found, got my first tick on me already this morning. Guy was trying to hitch a ride. He was, he just landed on me. He, he wasn't in bed or anything. Right, right on my left knee, I looked down. I was like, that's a pretty big piece of dirt. Yeah, it wasn't, he was a tick. Look all these deer in this guy's backyard. They're just sitting here looking at me. So this is all a natural wildlife area. I'm gonna walk along here and apparently walk around it all the way over to like way over there on that point before we go up in the mountains over there. But we'll see some ducks and stuff out here. Well, that was cool. I just met um, Miles from Rachel's Adventure. She follows my channel and ju she just came out of the woods as I'm getting ready to go back in the woods. Um, so that was pretty cool. We got to um, chat for here for a minute and uh, <laughs> It's always amazing to me why I run across people it's out of nowhere like you know the trail community and it's it's awesome like and it's just yeah it's awesome like this out of the middle of nowhere just walking along and boom there's somebody and you know and you got the camaraderie already so great meeting you let's get in the woods so apparently this is a really long boardwalk is what uh mouse was saying so it's cool, I like boardwalks. So, just gonna walk through the woods for a while. All right, coming into Poe Chuck Mountain Shelter. It's a tiny one. It's got a bear box though. Actually looks pretty new too. Oh, it's actually not bad. I easily sleep six in here huh. little picnic table not bad some good tenting on the way here all right here's the view down there on the bottom you can see that's the water area I walked around a little bit ago the wildlife preserve and let's see if we zoom out all the way out there there's the monument I walked past yesterday pretty cool 
It's that far away. Okay, that's that's no zoom right there. Pretty far. Pretty sweet. Coming up to another bridge. This one's nice. Oh, a nice creek too. Should have stopped here and got water. It's a ni nice creek. All right, this is awesome. Um, I couldn't figure out what it was, but we got nature boardwalk. Um, I think I'll walk all the way through this valley. I love these boardwalks. This is like uh, up in Vermont. They got these, they're so nice. Just relaxing and get to look around, down to where about falling. Pretty cool. Check out this curvy part. Not sure why they didn't make it straight, but it's pretty neat. Just snakes through the, the grasslands here. All these reeds and stuff. Pretty cool. Oh, and there's a there's a deer. There's a couple deer. Oh, there's a baby. There you can see just behind. You can see the baby there, the baby fawn out oh, there. The guys went and hid with his mama. <laughs> that was cool. I just happened to see him and the fawn moved so I could uh, actually see it. Now this is a bridge. This is part of the boardwalk. I can definitely say this is the longest boardwalk I've ever been on. I was just looking, I think it's just over a mile. Oh, this is a cool bridge. This is pretty cool. It's over a little river here. I'll tell you, Jersey definitely did it right for this section of trail I've been on. Because they got the boardwalks. And so walking through the swampy mud and stuff um, and tearing up all the trail, they put all these boardwalks down and they're nice. Keep the feet dry. Keep moving. Alright, made it here to Heaven Hill Farm. It's a farmer market. And this has got the apple cider donuts. I'm going in. Okay, here at the farmer's market, I got a Joe's strawberry lemonade. And three apple cider donuts. Well, just had my three donuts, my strawberry lemonade. I'm on a sugar coma right now. Gotta get moving to burn that off. Yeah, also I ate uh, my normal lunch on my pack because I needed to eat that instead of buying food because I got a lot of food. All right, time to walk back to the trail. It's just point one and head up the mountain. All right, back in the woods and gotta climb. I think it's a 1200 foot. It's a climb. Now this pile took some work to clear off a couple campsites here. Holy cow. That pile is huge. It's probably 15 feet tall. It's an intersection, but you could totally camp right there. All right, I'm not sure why there is a mailbox up here. There's just, there's a mailbox. Old AT um, visitor property, apparently. That's, that's what we Got a black bear down here looking at me. He's not, he can smell me for sure. So, Right after we saw the mail by itself, I was talking to another hiker. We're, while we're sitting there watching him, we start going about point one. I see another one running across the trail. When we look to the left, there was a mom with three cubs, but they were probably a year or two old cubs. They were pretty big. They just stood there. And we, of course, we just stood there, let her smell us, and uh, and then they just started slowly walking down the trail away from us and back off trail and they walked to the right the trail curved to the left kept going so saw five bears in less than five minutes 
that was awesome and unfortunately i couldn't get a video of the the four that would been really neat to get the mom and three cubs we would really like to send that to the forest service for a uh, id for them and uh, they were all all five bears were definitely super healthy and uh content that first one he just got beaten he didn't even he looked at me for a little bit on the video there and then he just went back eating again he didn't care and that's the way with mom and the cubs they she didn't care she could smell me she don't care so that's pretty awesome so six six uh bears in jersey so far i'm on my side of jersey but man that's awesome it's crazy <laughs> all right just coming into the Waiwanda shelter, I think is how you pronounce it. We got a bear box there, which obviously they need because of the bear activity. And let's check out this one. This one looks new too. It's like the earlier one today. That's kind of cool. Nice picnic table back here. Oh, some good camp tent camping. I was originally gonna come here, but I'm not. It's early. It's, it's only like 1:30, so but this has been nice. This tent camp and stuff. Don't want to keep going. Just take a break here. All right, coming up to something special. New Jersey, New York state line. Done with Jersey. Now in New York. That's the official line because there's the AT. All right, another state done, so let's mark them off. Georgia, done. Tennessee, done. Sorry, North Carolina, done. Tennessee, done. Virginia, done. West Virginia, done. Maryland, done. Pennsylvania, done. And now, New Jersey, done. In New New York, here we go. I don't know if it's going to show up, but the, right in the center of that is the New York City skyline. So it's, uh, you can just see the top of a couple of towers. But pretty cool. And there's some lake down there. It's got a lot of expensive houses there, for sure. Well, here's the kind of the trail in New York right now. It's just rock walking over these rocks. Here's part of the trail. Up we go. So here's the view outside my tent. Um, there's a little creek over here. And just a little grass area. Just still have to camp up for the night. All right, let's do an end of day recap for day 81. <clears throat> so um, started off this morning in Unionville at um, the Solus. Um, hostel which is the uh, basically the pastor's house um so got up got going went down to the uh, general store in town got um an egg sandwich some coffee ate that and walked out of town it's about a mile or so to get out of town back to the trail so i got to the trail and started hoofing um made it to that fresh market deli had the Three apple cider donuts, those were phenomenal. And then just kept walking a day, digging to see the New York City um, skyline from um, one of the viewpoints there. Hopefully you get to see that in the video if it comes out. And then made it here to a still site along some creek, just out in the woods, 23.9 for the day. So I was ready to be done, so Tomorrow. I'm not sure where I'm going to go, but um, yeah, I'm in New York, so this is Half Mile. Have a good night.